grade 8 learners, it's a wonderful day. Again, stay safe and healthy. Welcome to Valenzuela Live. Ma'am Rhea Pulgar, your teacher for today from Kanuma East National High School. Reminders for our online class. Please prepare the following. Paper, pen, and learning packets. Use the comment box for your attendance and answers to our activities. Enjoy learning! To start, our learning competency is perform basic mensuration and calculation. And under this competency, you are expected to convert English to metric system and metric to English system of measurements. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to number one, Identify the system of measurement. Number two, convert units of linear measurement. And third is, appreciate the importance of converting measurement from English to metric and metric to English. At this point, I want to measure your understanding regarding our previous lesson. This activity is entitled, Convert Me. What you will do is to convert the given fraction to decimal, write your answers on the comment box below. Are you ready? Let's go! Number 1. 1 for to decimal form is Your timer starts now. If your answer is 0 0.25, then you are correct. Let's proceed to question number 2. 3 fourth. Timer starts now. The answer is 0 0.75. Correct. Very good. Let's try the next number. 716. 5 seconds starts now. If your answer is 0 0.4375 or 0 0.43, you got it right! Question number 4. 3 -8. Your timer starts now. If your answer is 0 0.3750 or 0 0.38, you are doing good. And for our last number, 1-8. 5 seconds starts now. If your answer is 0 0.125, then you are correct. Great job! It is amazing that you got a perfect score for this activity. It seems that you are now ready for the next lesson. Right now, we are in Sean's room. Our job is to help Sean know the appropriate units of measurement to be used when measuring big and small objects. Are you ready? All right, let's dig in. He wants to know the width of the door. Is it yard or centimeter? If your answer is yard, you are correct. Nice start. He wants to know the length of the floor. Should we use meter or centimeter? The answer is meter. You're doing good. Let's continue. For the third time, he wants to know the length and width of his learning packets. Is it centimeter or millimeter? The answer 
एट सेंटीमीटर एक्सेलेंट इट सीम्स यू आर ऑलरेडी विद आवर लेसन इट सीम्स यू आर ऑलरेडी विद आवर लेसन टूडे एम आई राइट ओके कन्वर्शन ऑफ यूनिट्स We have two units of measurement. The first one is English system. The English system provides a creative way on how people can measure themselves. For example, people measure a shorter distance on the ground with their feet. They measure shorter distance by their palm, which is equal to yard, inch, and mile. And the other units of measurement used is the metric system. It's a system. It's a decimal system of measurement. It exists in several variations with different choices of base units. The basic as a unit or international system of units is called meter. One meter is equivalent to one hundred centimeters. And each centimeter is composed of ten millimeters. In English system of measurement, we have twelve inches is equal to one foot, three feet is equal to one yard, and one yard is equal to thirty-six inches. We also have an English conversion table. One inch is equal to twenty-five point four millimeter, two point fifty-four in centimeters, and zero point zero two fifty-four in meters. One foot is equal to three hundred four point eight millimeter, thirty point forty-eight in centimeter, and zero point thirty forty-eight in meters. One yard is equal to nine is equal to nine hundred fourteen point four millimeter. In centimeter, it has ninety-one point four, and in meters, it has zero point ninety-one forty-four. This is the metric conversion table. One millimeter is equal to zero point zero thirty-nine thirty-seven inch. One centimeter is equal to zero point thirty-nine thirty-seven inch, and one meter is equal to thirty-nine point thirty-seven inches. In conversion of units of measurement. We can use different formula. Length in inch multiplied by zero point zero two fifty four is equal to length in meter. Length in inch multiplied by two point fifty four is equal to length in centimeter. And length in feet divided by three point thirty eight is equal to length in meter. Length in meter multiplied by thirty nine point thirty seven is equal to length in inch, and length in inch divided by thirty nine point thirty seven is equal to length in meter. Length in feet multiplied by zero point three zero five is equal to length in meter, and length in feet multiplied by thirty point five is equal to length in centimeter. Let's have an example. Convert eighty centimeter to inch. Remember that in English conversion table, one inch is equivalent to two point fifty four centimeter. We are going to have a conversion factor. The given is eighty centimeter. Multiply to the fraction one inch over two point fifty four centimeter. Cancel the common unit, which is centimeter. And continue multiplying eighty to one inch and divide by two point fifty four. The answer is thirty one point four ninety six inches. Let's proceed to the next example. Convert four inches to centimeter. Remember that one inch is equivalent to two point fifty four centimeter. The given is. Four inches multiplied to two point fifty four centimeter over one inch. Let us cancel the common units, which is inch. Then multiply four to two point fifty four centimeter, and the answer is to ten point sixteen centimeters. Next example: To 
convert 75 centimeter to meter, in 1 meter is equivalent to 100 centimeter. We just need to multiply 75 centimeter to 1 meter over 100 centimeter and cancel the common unit which is centimeter. Continue multiplying 75 to 1 meter and divide the answer by 100. Then our answer is 0 0.75 meter. Let's proceed to our last example. Now, let us convert 30 centimeter to feet. In one foot, we have 30.48 centimeter. We have 30 centimeter multiplied to one foot over 30.48 centimeter. First, let us cancel the common unit, which is the centimeter. Then multiply 30 to 1 foot, which give us 30 feet over 30.48. Dividing the numbers will give us an answer of 0 0.984 foot. And now, let's measure how deep your understanding is regarding this lesson. Let us have a short quiz to know if you really understand the lesson. Get your notebook and pen and use the chat box to write your final answer. Number one. What is the answer if you convert 11 inches to centimeters? Your timer starts now. What is your answer? The answer is 27.94 centimeters. Good job! How long is 16 meters feet? Your timer starts now. If your answer is 52.49 feet, you are doing great. Let's continue. Sean measures the floor of his room using a meter stick. And its length is 9 meters. What is 9 meters in inches? Your timer starts now. If your answer is 354.33 inches, you got it right. Well done. Let's see if you can do the next number. Problem number four. Jack's table measures 5 meters. Well, Joseph's table is 350 centimeters long. Whose table is longer? Timer starts now. If your answer is John's table, excellent! Because it is 150 centimeters longer than Joseph. Let's see if you can perfect this quiz. Let's proceed to the problem number 5. Donna made a 6 yard long curtain, while Mika made a 216 inches long curtain. Which of them made the longest curtain? Time starts now. What is your answer? Don't so, have the same length of curtain. Since 6 yards is equivalent to 216 inches. If you get a perfect score, you did an amazing job. To sum up our lesson, please complete these three important lines. I know, I will do, I will share. Write the answer in your module or your activity notebook and submit it to your subject teacher. For now, I will give you my answer that will serve as your guide in completing the test activity. 
I know that the two systems of measurement are the English and metric system. I will do the proper way and procedure in converting linear measurement. And I will share this knowledge to my family and friends. If you have any questions or clarification, just ask your subject teacher. For sure, they love to answer all your questions. For your assignment, answer post test in your learning packet, page 21. This ends our discussion today with many mechanical dropping exploratory through Venezuela life. Again, I'm Amrea F. Fulgar, your PLE teacher from Kadumi East National High School. Leaving you this goal, you cannot convert people beyond your own conversion. Ano man ang sitwasyon, tuloy ang edukasyon. Happy morning! Goodbye!